Okay, so today I was thinking about making a story of my own. Then I thought, well, some people aren't as good at like just going with something. So I thought maybe a video would help them figure out how to make a story of their own. So first we want characters. Because if you make a story without characters, is it even going to be a story? So, first make one circle in the middle of a paper. That we are going to put the face of your character to know what your character looks like so you can be like, um, the sun, the light of the sun reflected off of her, um, beige hair or like brown hair or whatever hair your, type of hair your character has or like, um, uh, and there's a whole bunch of ways but to describe your character or you can like make pictures of your character but without a design for your character people are going to be like hmm what's the character look like so yeah but then you there will be a few things you need for there for there to be a memorable character what like what's the name so put the name over, put the name like on the top of the circle. So the name of my character will be, um, how about Stella? Stella! First name what came to mind, cause Stella Luna. Mm -hmm. Um, and then like, so, relationships, like who are their friends, who are their siblings, if they have siblings, do they have a dog, if so, put the dog's name, just all the relationships they have with people, even enemies. Relationships. So that sort of thing, and then like, what and then their abilities what are they good at do they have magic or do they have like a good cooking skill like me yeah mom my mom is good at cooking some things other things she free hands it like once like she makes the best chili and taco soup and she made really good, what was that thing called? Like rice, chicken, what was it? I don't know, arroz con pollo. Arroz con pollo, yeah. So then, like, are they good at cooking? Are they good at, like, uh, or do they have the ability to control thunder and lightning? Or do they have the ability to uh, talk to animals? Or are they good mm. with handling animals? So... Um, a bill it tees. So, for example, mine is going to be uh, they can control sun, the sun, so controls sun. And they're also going to uh, be athletic. How do you spell mm -hmm. athletic? It's A-T-H-L-E-T. L-E-T. I see. I see. Okay, and they're going to be like, so, in fact, your main character could be an animal if they want to, if you want to, like, it could be, a butterfly or a human or like in a world with magic it could be a dragon and a human it could be half dragon half human there are infinite possibilities it's all you for it gets to control what ha what the character is okay and then you you can and then you will have to put if it's a good character or evil character because you don't want to look at your character plans and be like Okay, so, so, um, is it an evil sun goddess or an, e or a good sun goddess? Like, what is it? So then I'm going to put good. 
um, or and you're going so then you're going to basically also put like what it is is it a goddess is it a normal thing until this one event happened or is it just a normal and you'll describe a life of a thing in a fictional world like the life of a lizard human or the life of an alien anything like that that you know and so then good and you can put as many things as you want like just anything like can spawn blankets from their arms like that's very random how did mm -hmm. i get the idea my dog's chewing on a blanket right now so mm -hmm. then and sola is going to be a um good demon Human character could be a good demon if you want. Like my character is. And then like, what? And so then, a personality, that is important. Personality. Um, so my character, is going your character can be like boring or they can be fun or they can be um tired all the time mm -hmm. yeah there's just so much stuff and you can and you've got to decide is it a main character mm -hmm. is it so stella is going to be um main character's sister Main character's sister. And so her personality is going to be caring. You can put like healing, kind, nice, good. You can put like a whole bunch of synonyms just for one word to describe her. Or you could put like healing, um, protective, laid back. Mm -hmm. um, she's mm -hmm. going to be like they can even be like a little nosy or anything like that. They can be a person who wants to be a dog. Mm -hmm. I mean, I can't well like, I definitely don't ever want to be a dog. Um, But so then, yeah, there's a whole bunch of stuff and she's going to be caring and smart. <laughs> You can even put dumb. Like, so yeah. for the villain, the villain's always going to be da -da -da -da, stupid. Okay. And then, like, so there's a whole bunch of other stuff you can add. For example, like, uh, it would be a lot easier to come up with ideas if I didn't have dogs growling in the background. <laughs> dogs, girls, <laughs> they do not understand me. But like, you can put like what language they speak, like if they speak two different languages or if they speak one language. Like also, um, then like you can put their favorite foods or you can add as much character as you want bring it to life in fact make it like a real thing in the real world even if it's a made-up character but it's a demon mm -hmm. but just put as much character into it 
there's going to have, but if you want a good story, there's going to have to be at least two characters, so might as well just put two characters like so. In my story, there's going to be like the sister, who's going to basically be a sidekick to the main character. There's going to be a villain, which is going to be an evil angel, in fact. Mm. And I'm just going to mix up a whole bunch of stuff and make my readers be like, oh, wait, this happened next? Because I want, because it's going to be a story where they have to follow along instead of just do the first page, skip all the way to like the third last page, and then they're going to be like, okay, so there once was this main character who was a good demon, blah, 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 and she took down the evil angel, the end, and what? They're not going to understand. Mm -hmm. So, you want to make sure that they read all through, and yeah. That's all I've got to say. Bye!